Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm gonna show you something my dad just recently bought. This is my dad's new 1996 Jeep Grand Cherokee Limited. My dad got this thing for $500. It was a really good deal because um, we're going to be using that over here on the land and he's going to be pulling his Mustang with the trailer right there. So I just wanted to kind of show you a little video of this thing. It's got brand new tires on it. Actually, I've been driving it around the land here. We've been pulling trees with it over there. But I think it's a pretty nice vehicle for this kind of little money. The motor and it's worth more than that. Like I said, it is a Grand Cherokee Limited. You don't really see too many of these. Start off with the interior. The interior is in really good shape. Um, just the little wear and tear over the years. The, this window um, over there is messed up, but it's got both the original key fobs and they still work. Leather interior, which is in good shape. The headliner is in good shape up front, but in the very back back there, it is kind of sagging. But what can you expect? It is a $500 vehicle is what we got it for. <laughs> but the reason why um, the dash is apart right now is because my dad's trying to get the gauge cluster working. Um, but it's a really nice vehicle. The tag expired, 8 of 13. It is a 5.2 liter V8. Just like my my Dodge Durango that I had, it had the same engine. But the spare tire is brand new and has never been used, I don't think, because it's got the cover and everything on it. So, yeah. Hang on, let me... The shocks are bad. But let me know what you guys think uh, so far. I think it was a heck of a deal for $500. Wait till you hear this thing run. It's got the old wood accent. Seats are all good. Whole vehicle's nice. It's got also got the original owner's manual as well. I'm gonna show you under the hood real fast. It is, oh, never mind. The hood latch is broken, I can't get it. Sorry. But I'm gonna go ahead and start this thing up for you guys. Show you guys what we got for this little amount of money. It's got the illuminated ignition at nighttime. It runs. The only thing wrong with it is, is all these gauges does not work. Everything else works. The heat works. And the radio works. Call 800 489 3252. It's got good heat in it. it works good. Like I said, um, we got all the owner's manuals with it. It's in the glove box though. Parking brake. Even the four wheel drive works in it. Transmission's good because I'm sure that's one thing you guys are probably like. Yeah, transmission's good. It goes forward and it goes backwards. Also, shifts good too. Motor runs good. Blinkers and everything work in it. It's just the main gauges do not work. Everything else works. It's also got really nice in, uh, floor mats, original floor mats as well. Um, they're dirty, of course, but I mean, just look at it. There's not really, like, see? It's not even messed up, really. So, what you guys think so far? Was this a good deal? Let me know in the comments. The sunroof does work, but it don't really go, sometimes it don't like to go forward again. But... Yeah, I guess I can do a little driving of it too. Also, you got this little memory to program your seat the way you want it. 
This thing's strong too. Hmm. Let me tell you, this thing is really strong. I really like this thing. It was a really good deal for the little amount of money we paid for it. Just cause I really don't know why they even parked it. Cause it had been parked for a year. And I, I have to say, it's probably because this dash is not working. But we've been using it. We pulled them logs right there. But it was a good deal for what we paid for it. So I guess the question of this video is, can you buy a good vehicle for $500? Oh, we're gonna touch. I guess that's the main question. Can you buy a vehicle for a good vehicle for $500? This thing's strong. time there's really not no body damage it does have a um sadly it does have a salvage title but my dad don't mind it he's gonna be using this thing it runs strong so in the comments guys let me know what you guys think please hit that subscribe button